Hey YouTube family, it's Gwendolyn. Britain's behind the camera, so this will be a little bit easier to explain. We get a lot of questions about decoration for the holidays. So Britain's panning to my kitchen area, um, or my dining room area, I should say. These are all little things I picked up from Dollar General and the Dollar Tree. I'm not gonna feel sad about donating them afterwards. We've got some nice blankets. I explained during the Thanksgiving season that with the blankets, we also don't feel bad purchasing those because we can repurpose them over by the fire pit. And let's face it, we have three kids, so we always need new blankets. Um, pillows, we always get the zip pillows, so you can buy those on Amazon and then just restuff them. They can fold under the bed. We did another blanket here. Over on this side, again, guys, it looks like, I think it looks beautiful. A lot of this is Dollar Tree, Dollar General, um, TJ Maxx, stuff that I'm not gonna feel bad about donating, things that I love and I wanna keep. I am gonna get a little rubber made and keep. And keep. We did snag our stockings from home because we felt like they were flat and we could really kind of like save them and then stuff them under the bed. Over on here, if you have kids, guys, this is a really great way to decorate. The kids, we picked these up from Target. It also coupled with a really nice learning activity for them. The kids' books, again, something we were already going to have, so it wasn't a lot of money spent. So the kids got to decorate this whole area. We did the little garland. We placed our tree in this um, location. I actually saw somebody else do this on, I think it was Instagram. So originally, we had thought about placing the tree over here, um, and we went back and forth, but we took a family vote, and we actually love the tree right here. So I'm curious to see what you guys think about that. Um, that was another Walmart purchase. Really thin, tall. It says it's six feet. I don't know. Britain's six six. He's shaking his head no. Um, again, the Jayco comes with this glass so we can write on it, which is great. In the kitchen, same concept, guys, as Thanksgiving. I coupled a lot of mugs, which again, I don't feel terrible about um, sending them to the thrift store. Fruit, guys, this is such a great way to decorate your kitchen. Um, I love putting fresh fruit out in our kitchen. So apples, oranges, you could also do um, fresh cranberries. Then if you pan this way, a cutting board, which we will use. Um, and then here, I just hung a little ornament, okay? So a lot of the little things you're seeing that are hung up are just ornaments that I found. Fa la 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 from Target. Again, I did the dish towels. I don't feel bad about re-gift, not re-gifting them. If you find a dish towel for me, I've not re-gifted it to you. Repurposing or thrift storing that. We're gonna always use these, so that's a purchase that we would have done anyways. Um, and that's it. The kids did a beautiful chain um, to count down for Christmas. Again, if you have kids, it's just a great way to like get them involved. So hopefully Britain can maybe back up and get the Christmas tree for y'all so you can see it. Um, oh, there is one more thing I wanted to point out. So with RV life, what do you buy? Like everywhere you go, you want to buy stuff. At least I do. So we made a pack when we first started doing this travel that we would buy only intentional items for our RV. And shortly after we started to visit the national parks and national monuments, we really found that we wanted to do ornaments. So Britain is doing a really good job panning over there. I love it. Anyways, that's a lot of our Christmas tree. I've been storing those in my room in just like a little Tupperware. Um, and then obviously once we're done with RV life, which we will at some point, these are going to be great reminders. I'm really hopeful that someday we have just a tree that's all national monuments and national parks from our travels. So, all right, guys, that's it. Drop in the comments below. Let me know if you want to see something else. Um, Please like, share, subscribe. We love that you're here. Let us know what you're wanting to see this holiday. Um, head over to Instagram if you really want to see everyday life and what we're doing. We share every day there. So thank you guys. Remember our, our sign off is do it now. You don't have to buy an RV and go full-time RV, but go do what you want to do. Go explore. Happy holidays, and we'll see you guys soon. Thank you.